These are the weapons that I think you should be using as a controller player in Apex Legends. So I'm going to rate them on how good they are in the hands of controller player um, and also how good they are in general. So uh, I am going to take all the carry package weapons and place them already in S tier because they are just ridiculous whether they're in anyone's hands. So first I'm gonna start off with the ARs, Havoc. I think it's A tier right now. Even with the spin up, it is still really, really good. It's got the fastest time to kill in the game. Amazing weapon, I love it. So I might get a little heat on the 301, but I'm gonna put it in B. It's not an A because it's just not doing enough damage, I don't think. Um, it, they did tighten the spread, which I love. So it's a lot easier to hit your shots with it. Um, I wouldn't pick it up over a couple of the other. Nemesis. Nemesis hits freaking hard. And the spin up on it behind, I'm gonna put it in A because it's just great long range, short range, mid range, everything. Um, the hip fires on it, pretty decent. Uh, they did tighten the spread a little bit more this season, so I think it's great in the controller hands. It was not last season, it was terrible. I couldn't hit nothing with that thing. Hemlock, this thing is ridiculous. Single fire with Hemlock, so good. If you guys are not running single fire long range, you're missing out. Flatline. I think it's also up there. It's really good. It puts out a lot of damage, puts out range, any range it's really good at. Love it. Now let's move on to the light machine guns. L-Star. I think it's really good. I think it's really, really decent. Um, Devotion. Why are people picking this up? Without a turbocharger, I don't know why people pick it up, honestly. I will only put it in my sling when I'm running ballistic. That's about it. But usually I will pick up something else. Rampage. I think people are sleeping on the Rampage. I don't think it's great. I don't think it's terrible though. So I'm gonna put it C. Especially if you can find some thermites. The thermites are everywhere. Um, I've, I think they got a little bit uh, better. I don't know what they did to it recently, but it's, it's really decent. Spitfire. Same. I think it's pretty good. Now, if we move on to the SMGs. Hmm. Car. It's amazing. I love the car, the versatility, having multiple types of ammo choices. Great. Love it. Volt as well. Volt is nasty this season. Nasty, especially for controller players. Even though we can't put uh, any digi threats on them anymore, they're still really, really good. Alternator, I wish it was a little bit better. I think it's really good with disruptor rounds. It would be up in A, maybe S, if you just brought up the uh, fire rate. That's about it, but I'm gonna put it in B for right now. I'm gonna get some crap for this. This used to be my favorite weapon, I'm just saying, dude. But I will not pick it up anymore. I barely pick it up. It's good, I don't think it's bad as, as bad as the Devotion. Um, I will pick it up rarely, but if I find a car, I'm gonna pick up a car or a Volt. Like, there's no reason to pick up a 99 right now. It's, it, eh. it saddens me. Anyways. Especially with the skin that they just cut out. Why'd they put out a second skin for the 99? That pisses me off too, by the way. Anyways, won't go there. 30-30. Let's go to the marksman weapons. 30-30 hits so freaking hard. It's hella annoying. Um, I hate that the reload is back to one. Otherwise, I'd put it in A tier. G7. I think everyone's sleeping on the G7 right now. I think it's really, really good. Especially like uh, for controller players, it's really decent. Hit fire everything. So um, I'm not that, I don't feel like it's amazing. I think it's really good though. Triple take. I love the triple take. I think it's actually A tier. And hear me out. The spin up on the choke is way faster now. And the aim down sights, I don't know if you guys like peak corners with it, it is. Mm, it's so delicious. I love it. P2020. This is a filler. F is for filler weapon. If you don't have any other weapon in sight, you cannot find any other weapon, you, you're grabbing a P2020. It's not bad with the hop ups, honestly. Like, I've killed so many people with the P2020 and hop up. It's great. Like, it is a weapon that you don't carry on purpose. <laughs> uh,. RE45, I think it's pretty decent. I think it's really good. I don't think 
I don't think it's terrible. I don't think it's amazing. I think it's a good spot right now. Charge rifle. Oh, I'm just terrible with this weapon. That's just me. I think it's crap. A lot of people love it. And they think it's a fantastic. So because of me, I'm going to put in C. Longbow. I think longbows are really good. I think I would rather use a marksman weapon. Um, I'm only using snipers at this point for the challenges. <laughs> I rarely pick up a sniper. I will pick up a marksman weapon before that if I want range. Like the hemlock does better job. So uh, remember this is for controller. Calm down, all right? Same with Sentinel. I think the Sentinel is really good. I think uh, even if without a sight, I think it's really good. Um, actually, I might put that a little bit higher. Let's put it up in B. I think that's really good. Shotguns. Oh man, I totally missed the Prowler. My bad, dude. Where are you hiding at? Prowler. Let's put this guy up here. Dude, Prowler is slapping the crap out of people. I'll pick the car first, but like the Prowler is a really, really good secondary. Mastiff. Why are we all hitting like eights on this sucker? I don't know what's going on this season. It just feels weird. I don't know why. Um, I think it's good. Mozambique here. Yeah. All right, so I don't think it's a filler weapon in any case. I think it's actually a good secondary. Um, when you need that hip fire or just some range, like you can hit some shots with this. It feels like somewhat of a wingman. Um, in shotgun form. I would actually put it in B tier. I think it's pretty good. Peacekeeper. This thing is wrecking people this season. Oh my gosh. Especially in a controller hand. It's really good. I think they, they buffed it a little bit more than the Mastiff or something. I don't know what they did, but I'm hitting my shots, slapping the crap out. I'm not, I feel like I'm not hitting eights anymore, you know? I'm feeling like that with the Mastiff. But that is me. Let me know what you guys think. This is my tier list. I think this is really good. I don't think, um, I think there's a lot of good weapons. Um, even the 99, like even with all the nerfs that they've done to it, it's still viable, but I'm still not gonna pick it up over these weapons. So I'm sticking with A, like S through B tier weapons. Um, C, like and down, not really picking them up. I will be using other weapons, so. So that's my tier list. I hope you guys like this video. Uh, what do you guys think of this season? I know there's a lot of cheaters. I know there's a lot of cheaters right now. I don't know if you experienced any. Send me some clips because I want to do a video on that. If you see any cheaters in your games, send them to me uh, in my Discord channel, link down below. And if you didn't like my tier list, come join me on my streams Friday through Monday, 9 p.m. Eastern time. Tell me what's up. Let me know what you think. What was I wrong about? Tell me. I'll argue it. I think these this is a good tier list. So come fight me. 1v1 me. Kisses. We'll see you guys in the next video. Come join the streams anytime. Love to see you there. Subscribe!